We will now talk about adjusting belt tension. To complete this utility, all we will need is a 3mm hex key and a mobile device equipped with a tuner app. The print head on your printer is moved using a system of motors, pulleys, and belts. For optimal operation, it is important that the belt tension is maintained at the correct level. Excessive belt tension will contribute to premature bearing wear and insufficient belt tension can lead to reduced printing accuracy and or dislocations. Since belts stretch over time, it is recommended that users occasionally, or every 500 print hours, measure belt tension and adjust as necessary. This can be done with any device that allows you to measure audible frequency in hertz. One inexpensive option is to use a mobile device equipped with a free version of either Fine Tuner app for iOS or Fine Chromatic Tuner app for Android. These applications are designed to tune musical instruments, but they can also be used as accurate frequency meters. I would like to note, some users have reported technical issues with the Android Tuner apps. To ensure accurate measurements, always take frequency adjustments in quiet surroundings. To begin, we will turn the printer off and manually place the print head in the back left corner of the print chamber to more easily access the belt underneath the Y rail opposite of the print head. Next, we will open a tuner app on our mobile device. If we are using Find Tuner app for iOS, you can disregard the lower of the two numbers on the main screen. Next, we will place our phone's microphone close to, but not touching, the belt opposite of the print head. Pluck that belt as if it was a guitar string and use the 3mm hex key to adjust the belt tension until the app reads a frequency of between 82 and 84 Hz. Once the belt is at the target frequency, we can reset the belt tension counter on our device. Updating this counter will allow your device to warn you proactively when the belt tension next needs to be adjusted. To reset this counter, simply navigate to the menu, Utilities, Maintenance, Maintenance Schedule. Here are some tips for the best results. Make measurements in quiet surroundings. If you cannot secure a quiet environment, consider investing in a shotgun condenser microphone to plug into your mobile device. Remove any protective case on your phone if necessary to get the most accurate reading. Place your phone's microphone close to, but not touching the belt. Do not over pluck the belt such that it vibrates against the gantry plate. And when initially plucking the belt, it will introduce harmonics at a multiple of the fundamental frequency. These will quickly die off and you will be left with only the fundamental frequency. For this reason, ignore early readings that appear to have measured as a multiple of your target frequency. With a little practice, you will obtain highly repeatable and accurate results in under 2 minutes.